வெல்கம் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் இன் திஸ் வீடியோ வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு லேர்ன் அபவுட் லாகிருதமிக் ஆம்பிஃபயர் த எலக்ட்ரானிக் சோக்யூட்ஸ் விச் பெர்ஃபார்ம் த மேத்தமெட்டிக்கல் ஆப்ரேஷன் சச்சஸ் லாகிருதம் அண்ட் ஆன்டி லாகிருதம் தட் இஸ் எக்ஸ்பனன்ஷியல் வித் அண்ட் ஆம்பிளிஃபிகேஷன் ஆர் கால்டஸ் லாகிருதமிக் அண்ட் ஆன்டி லாகிருதமிக் ஆம்பிளிஃபயர் ரெஸ்பெக்டிவ்லி லெட் சி லாகிருதமிக் ஆம்பிஃபயர் வாட் இஸ் லாகிருதமிக் ஆம்பிஃபயர் A logarithmic amplifier or another name is log amplifier is an electronic circuit that produces an output that is proportional to the logarithm of the applied input. So normally the electronic circuits produces an output that output voltage is proportional to the logarithm of the applied input voltage is called logarithmic amplifier. In this section we discusses about op-amp based amplifier. logarithmic amplifier in detail so this is the circuit diagram of this is the circuit diagram of logarithmic amplifier an op amp based logarithmic amplifier produces a voltage at the output which is proportional to the logarithmic of the voltage applied to the resistance connected to its inverting terminal so here we are using log amplifier in this log amplifier circuit we are using diode this diode is used in negative feedback path in this circuit the non inverting input terminal of the op amp is connected to ground that means zero volt is applied at the non inverting input terminal of the op amp according to the virtual short concept the voltage at the inverting this is the inverting terminal the voltage at the inverting input terminal of the op amp will be equal to the voltage at its non inverting input terminal so the voltage at the inverting input terminal also zero so va is equal to by with the virtual ground concept va is equal to zero then vb is also zero now we are going to find current flowing through the resistance r that is inverting terminal so we are using ohms law here ohms law i is equal to v by r so here the current flow uh, current is we are taking the current is if so if is equal to v in minus vb divided by r that means the voltage difference between these resistance is v in minus vb so v in minus vb divided by r so we know that is vb is equal to 0 so we are substituting vb is equal to 0 here then if is equal to v in divided by r take this is equation number 1 next we are going to write the equation for current flowing through a diode is if is equal to is e power vf divided by eta vt This is the equation for current flowing through a diode when it is in forward bias. So here we know that is 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 the saturation current of the diode. This VF is voltage drop across diode when it is forward bias. VT is diode's thermal equivalent voltage. Next we are going to apply KVL equation. Kirchhoff voltage law in this loop section. That means we are the KVL equation around the feedback loop. This is the feedback loop. Here we are going to apply the KVL equation. So in this loop, so here the node voltage is VB. Here the voltage is VF. Diode voltage is VF. And this end, the voltage is V0. So if you are applying voltage, Kirch of voltage law here, Vb minus Vf minus V0. That is equal to 0. So that is Vb minus Vf minus V0 is equal to 0. We know Vb is equal to 0. If we are substituting here, we will get minus Vf minus V0 is equal to 0. That is Vf is equal to minus V0. Now we are going to substitute this Vf value in this value. diode current equation that is if is equal to is e power we are calculating that is vf is equal to minus v not 
So we are substituting here minus V naught divided by eta Vt. So take this is equation number 3. Now we are going to equate equation number 3 and 1. So equation number 1 value is Vn divided by R. That is equal to Is e power minus V naught divided by eta Vt. So Is we are taking cross multiplication here. Then If is come denominator. So V in divided by ISR is equal to E power minus V naught eta Vt. So applying natural logarithm on both sides. So here ln V in by ISR that is equal to E and ln get cancelled. So we will get minus V naught divided by eta Vt. That is V naught is equal to from this we are going to calculate V naught. So V naught is equal to eta Vt. Uh, here comes the numerator that is V naught is equal to minus eta Vt ln V in divided by ISR. So here this ISR is the constant DC voltage. Let us as denote it as V reference. So V reference is equal to ISR. So therefore the output voltage V naught is equal to now we are going to substitute here ISR is equal to V reference. So V naught is equal to minus eta Vt ln V in divided by V reference. From this equation, output voltage V naught has a negative sign which indicates that there is there exists a 180 degree phase shift between input and output. So this is the output voltage of logarithmic amplifier. Thus the output voltage V naught is the function of output voltage V naught is the function of logarithm of the input voltage V in. Thank you friends.